Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Everledger. Today I am back another Pixel Gun 3D video. So back when I did that last top 10 epic primary weapons in Pixel Gun 3D, uh, there was one weapon that stood out to me because I was very, very surprised to see how well it performed. And I told you guys I was going to do a weapon review on it in the next upcoming days. And you guys would see that in a few days from them. Well, now this video is going to be out. It's the same day I'm recording that last video. But it's going to be out a few days after that. Um, so anyways, that is going to be, we'll come over here, that is the gum rifle, and the reason why this thing stood out to me is because it was literally a two-shot headshot and a two-shot body shot, and I just wanted to get a separate view on it just to see how it does if you use it the entire time throughout a game, because obviously, in that last video, it was just a bunch of my subscribers letting me test weapons out on them, that's why I had several violence kills in it, uh, several rampages and everything like that. But anyways, we have the gum rifle over here. And basically specs for this weapon at level 65, we have fire, firing rate of 74, capacity of 6, mobility of 65, rocket slows the targets and area damage, and I have kinetic damage 20%, bullet dispersion reduction 35%, and reload acceleration 40%. So that is what I have for those weapons right there, and um, for this weapon right here. And we're going to take this into a game and hopefully just kill a bunch of people and pop off. So uh, I think I'm going to go into... Um, you're probably going to be like, don't do silent school. Don't do silent school. You always do silent school. I'm assuming that's what you guys are thinking, but I don't know what other maps to go to. So let's just go to Atlantis, I guess. Those are the two maps I've been doing a lot recently of. So we'll hop into Atlantis with the gum rifle, and hopefully this thing just pops off. You guys do know I did the double gum a while back, and that thing did really, really well. So uh, hopefully this one will do just as well, and I can get a bunch of kills with this thing as well. But the only thing I'm kind of concerned with is the uh you're gonna be reloading quite a bit it looks like because uh it has a less amount of ammo you only have six bullets uh which is not the greatest that means you can get about three kills with each um magazine before you have to reload and where's this person at I might have to go to a different lobby i probably should have gone to silent school it's just it's just more efficient to uh, find people with this dude just hiding or something which is dumb oh right, we got dodo gamer 55 who just joined the game so shout out to you dodo gamer um so Let's just see if I can kill you real quick and hope for the best. So, okay, my aim is being awful right now. And there we go, got him. And hopefully the rest of the game goes just as well. So, um, let's just walk over here and try to clap these people. And where are you at? Uh, come on. The one thing I'm not a big fan of with this weapon is a huge travel time with this weapon. But if you are in closer range maps, that's not going to be a big problem because while well, you're closer and stuff like that so here we go right over here and you should be dead now but uh i keep missing there we go got you let me hit that med kit and uh let me hit that and of course he has gadget blocker i was just about to try to use my oh it's the ai pistol i was just about to try to use that uh, ability that i have for it but uh he used that and i couldn't get it off so um right over here we have dodo gamer i believe that is and of course he pulls up self-destruct no no, alright, alright, come on, come on, let's go, let's go, come on, why is this not hitting, thank you, thank you, I gotta reload, gotta reload, gotta reload, and of course, I did not get the reload off the AI pistol, dude, I did, how is he doing so much better, I, I'm just not a good we good with that weapon, so, um, come on, one more, there we go, you're dead, and let's hit this right here, and hope for the best, and one, and two, thank you, nice, and I'm gonna have to use that, um, that med kit fairly soon, to be able to survive and come on dude get out of my way i hate when your teammates get in your way and block your bullet from hitting your opponent that's one of the most annoying things ever and i just wish that couldn't happen but uh guess what it's gonna happen because uh that's just how this game works so where's this people at um where are they at where are they at where are they at? i just need some kills just need some kills it's not a bad weapon if you know how to use it you know it's just one of those weapons that it's good but it's not guaranteed that you'll do good and okay it's a one shot kill to that person because he's low level which is really 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 nice for me but um who knows maybe if you get this thing to a mythical maybe just maybe it'll be even better than this maybe it'll be a one-shot kill i'm not entirely sure if you guys want me to try that for a future video i can do my best and waste the gym to do that uh but it's not guaranteed that it's gonna be a one-shot kill so uh where are these people at i don't know where any of these dudes are so hopefully just hopefully we can uh find them and uh well kill them so, let's just jump down here, and I believe there's someone running over here now. Nope, okay. Where are these dudes at? Where's everyone at? Why are y'all just hiding, man? I just want to kill you. What's so scary about that? Jeez. So, um, where? Okay, these dudes need to move. All right, I see them, I see them, I see them. And there we go. 
and boom. How? How? Dude, that was directly on you. Dude! Okay, this is frustrating. This is frustrating. I just did so bad with the AI pistol a while back, and then this dude's just clapping everyone, and I don't like that because it's not fair. So, dude, how many times I gotta shoot you? How many times? <laughs> so, yeah, this weapon is... I don't want to say it's OP, because it's not. I mean, there's a lot of damage, but just how good is it? Like... You could do damage with it, which lots of weapons you can deal a good bit of damage with. But what good is that damage if you struggle to hit the shots because of the travel time? Because the travel time of this weapon is super low. I'm struggling to walk upstairs. The travel time of this weapon is super low, and it's just it's just one of like it's a good weapon, yeah. But just how many kills can you like regularly get with this weapon? Because it's, it's just that travel time is just really low and it's just something and this dude's getting frustrating Please stop guys. Ugh. I'm trying to mass record videos So I've been sitting here for like an hour just recording and like you guys don't understand the frustration that gives me So where's this dude at? Thank you. You're dead and we have the freaking AI pistol dude over here and come on Come on. Okay, dude. Did I get the kill? No, someone else stole him. Aw, oh, okay. Well, that's that and there's that and um, so Ah, so like I, it's it's a powerful weapon, and if you guys do know how to use weapons with really really large, um, what's it called? Really really large bullet travel time, then yeah, you might be able to do great with this weapon. But just like the last video I did on the AI pistol, if it's not a weapon that you really just know how to use, then you're not going to do well with it. This person is just sitting over here jumping around, which is making it harder to shoot because I don't know how to time my freaking bullets with this super freaking low bullet travel time um so like i just don't know how to use this weapon i'm just not good with it i don't understand so like let me know what you guys think about this do you, if you guys have this weapon let me know what you guys think about it because me personally i wish it had a little bit faster uh bullet travel time if it did it'd probably be considered op well, not really because it only has six bullets so developers if you're watching this increase this bullet uh increase this weapon's travel time and, uh, yeah, more people might use it. That'd be really, really helpful. Just don't make it to where it's OP, it's mess. But, um, yeah, I think that'd be a really great thing to do for this weapon and get more people using it. And, oh my gosh, stop using the offensive fireworks. You guys gotta stop that, man. Stop, stop, stop. So, uh, we have people right over here. And hopefully we can just kill them. And, uh, there we go. And, uh, let me get out of here because I don't want to die. So, uh, yeah, that's just... Don't want to die, so let's go up the stairs. Uh, and, of course... We have the freaking AI pistol, dude. Okay, I killed him. Thank you. So, um, we have how many kills? We have six kills. So, we're leading our team with kills right now. Somehow. But, uh, we're, we're like, at the bottom with points. So, all right. Well, he just died by, uh, Rigby 2.0. And, what? How did that catch me from all the way down there? What? That's weird. Um, uh, but, uh, I mean, when I tested this weapon, I was very, very interested to t try it out. But it's just not that great of a weapon. I mean, I don't want to say it sucks. Because obviously, if you know how to use it, it's going to be a pretty good weapon. But, like, maybe on hallways where people don't really have that much space to move around, it might be a bit better. So, Silent School might have been a better map to use this weapon on. But, I don't want to go to Silent School. Specifically, and it's a good thing I didn't go to Silent School. Because then, I would have probably made the video. And I probably would have done pretty good. Because the hallway... And I probably would have said, oh, this weapon's borderline overpowered. But now that I tested on this map, a more open map, a little bit slightly more open, um, you kind of just see it's not that good of a weapon. On, on open maps, this weapon's just, I mean, just to be completely honest, it's just not good. Uh, it's not good for maps like this because that bullet travel time. And uh, that just kind of ruins the weapon because... I mean, it makes it to where you can really only use it in super close range maps, just like shotguns. And, um, that would explain why it did very similar damage to the shotguns of the epic grade that it did in that video. So, I mean, it, it's, it's, it's a decent weapon, it just all depends on your play style, it all depends on the maps you're playing on. Uh, I wish it did a little bit better, I wish I could do a little bit better with open maps, but, um, you just can't because that slowdown time, the bullet slowdown, the bullet travel time. And it's just, I mean, it's just something you can't really help. But anyways, guys, that is going to be it for the, what's it called? The, um, 
the the gum rifle that's gonna be it for the gum rifle so let me know what you guys think about this weapon down below do you guys think it's good do you guys think it's bad me personally i think it can be good but it really all just depends on your play style and what map you're playing on i mean it's it's a pretty it's a pretty cool weapon it's a powerful weapon two shot kills it's just those two things i mean it's gonna be nice having to slow down slows the target and the area damage I mean, but it's just it's just one of those weapons where you just you can't really do that good when in in open maps. So if I went to something like uh, Nuclear City, I would have done off. I wouldn't have even got a kill on that map because I mean, you just it's too open. Or same thing with Heaven's Garden. So that's gonna be if the double if the gum rifle, not the double gum. Let me what you think about it. If you guys did enjoy the video, make sure you guys leave a like. Uh, if you guys do want to see more content, subscribe and turn on the bell notification. If you guys do want to support my channel, the best and easiest way to do that is simply just share my content wherever you can. Or if you're feeling generous, you guys can check out the merchandise link down below as well. And uh, check out my Discord link down link down below. Check out my Instagram and my Twitter as well. If you guys do check out my Instagram, I did tease a face reveal on there. Uh, so if that post gets enough support, I may just do a face reveal. So um, yeah, so check that out. With that being said, hope you guys all had a very blessed day, and I will see you all in the next video.